Who is taking him? Who's showing up and giving him the tour? Do we know? Uh, I think there were supposed to be some border agents. Here he is getting off the plane. Here he is in the middle with a hat waving to presumably uh, many a member of the media waiting for his, ar his arrival. So, so we know he's headed to the border. Uh, what, what, let me just read this. The Trump campaign released a statement today saying, quote, in part, despite the great danger, Mr. Trump is traveling to Laredo, Texas to proceed with the visit to the border. It is unfortunate the local union of Border Patrol agents received pressure at a national level not to participate and ultimately pulled out of today's event. It can only be assumed that there are things the politicians in Washington do not want Americans to see or discuss. It shows that we are not even safe in our own country. Um, what should we expect? Not that we have expectations in live events such as, <laughs> such as these involving uh, Mr. Trump, but, but what should we expect as far as his tour goes, availability, message? Look, I mean, I think it's clear that for Trump, the issue of illegal immigration is the core issue that he's interested in talking about. I think it's important to note that last week uh, there were some distractions from that goal for Trump when he made the comments about John McCain and questioning whether he was or was not a war hero. It was I McCain and then Lindsey Graham and then Rick Perry. It's gotten and very personal. Some, and then some phone throwing. Uh, <laughs> right. So I think that for him, making this visit is an important uh, step for him to bring the conversation back to this issue that he feels extremely passionate about and wants his campaign to be about you know, being a nationalist candidate, uh, talking about illegal immigration, and just the fact that the country is under assault. Um, MJ, thank you very much. I want to move on. The Border Patrol Union, not the only one Trump is calling out. His own party is also fair game. Trump telling the Hill newspaper that he might consider a third party bid if the Republican National Committee doesn't change its ways. I've got Bob Cusack with me, the editor in chief at the Hill. Um, he interviewed Donald Trump. So as we stay on these live pictures, Bob, uh, mm -hmm. you know, uh, I, great to have you on, by the way. Have you Thank back. You, um, you know, uh, I know that Trump told you. That